Let's sing hello, hello. Let's sing hello, hello. Hi, hello, dearie, ho. Let's sing hello, hello. Let's wave hello, hello. Let's wave hello, hello. Hi, hello, dearie, ho. Let's wave hello, hello. And stop. Hello, welcome to my little online session about the farm. Our next themes after Easter will be all about the farmyard. And so I thought I'd use Old MacDonald today to show you a couple of activities that you could do at home with your babies. Okay, so we're going to start off by doing a lap bounce. Now you can see I'm sat down with my legs out straight here. Okay, and this is probably the easiest way to bounce your baby because it just takes a little less effort for you rather than lots of upper body work. Okay, now you can have them facing away from you if you want to, but actually we quite like to have them facing towards us or facing towards you, particularly if you're just at home with them, so they can maintain eye contact with you and see everything you do and sing at them, which is really nice to bond with. Okay, so we're going to start off with a bounce. Um, but oh, sorry, monkey, you are not a farmyard animal. So I'm going to put my farmyard animal over here for now and get my doggy. And we're going to be the dog on the farm. The dog. Woof! Are you ready? Oh, MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a dog, woof, 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 E-I-E-I-O, with a woof, woof here and a woof, woof there, here, woof, there, woof, everywhere, woof, woof, oh, MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and stop. So when we bounce, we get the steady through feet through their whole body. If you've got a very small baby, you can obviously support their head as you do it. If you've got a bigger baby, whoa, probably the bigger, the better. Okay, so just go with what your baby likes and enjoys. Okay, but they'll feel the whole beat through their body whilst doing a lap bounce. Okay, <gasps> shall we find another animal? I think we will find another animal that goes... <gasps> It's going to go from side to side. So we're going to rock this one. Okay, so if you've got your baby on your lap, we're going to rock from side to side just to give them a bit of a challenge with their balance um, and to move them in a different direction and a different kind of um, space. Okay. Old MacDonald had a farm. He Probably 
you guessed it, we're gonna go up and down. <gasps> okay. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a donkey, E-I-E-I-O. With a e o here, and a e o there. Here a e, there a o, everywhere a e o. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and stop. So we have been bouncing. We went side to side like a duck, forwards and backwards, and up and down, which is all brilliant for developing our vestibular system, which is the system in our inner ear um, that controls our balance. So really important for crawling and then walking um, and so many things. So yeah, now we're gonna do some exercise with our baby. So can you lie them down now, down now, down now? Can you lie them down now, ready to exercise? So my baby is on their, on his back, okay? Um, which is a very good position for your baby to be. We sit them up a lot when they're not quite ready for it, especially if they're not a confident sitter. It's always best to land them on their backs so their arms and hands and legs are free to move around, okay? It also means they can start to twist and turn and roll um, as well. So on their backs, we can also maintain that eye contact as well. Freeze our hands up. Now you may have noticed I did a few signs for donkey, duck, dog, and oh horse <laughs> yeah so if you've got your hands free you can do some of those signs with your baby as well as make the sign for vocal play and also get some exercise so pop this over here so we can see those words and who are we going to have next i think we should have our pig and our pig goes Yeah, does your baby like that one? It's a very funny sound, isn't it? Okay. And whilst we do our pig, we are going to exercise our baby's bodies. I think we need to go up and down. So can you take your baby's legs or feet and make them go up and down slowly? And you may get some resistance and that's absolutely fine because it shows that they know where their feet are and they know where their legs are and they know what to do with them if they're pushing that resistance. Young babies won't. Okay, um, bigger babies also like this actually. Uh, I find even when they're crawlers, sometimes popping on their backs and just maintaining eye contact and having a playful time, um, you know, is really attractive to the older babies as well. Okay, I'm ready up. Done. Old MacDonald had a farm, E I E I O, and on that farm he had a pig. With a here, peekaboo, and a boo there, here, there, everywhere. Oh, MacDonald had a farm, e -I -E -I -O, and stop. <gasps> Fantastic. Who are we going to have next? I think we'll have our sheep. <gasps> we'll have our sheep. And our sheep goes bah, bah, bah. Now what should we do for our sheep? We're going to do a cross crawl, okay? So if your baby's not crawling, or even if they are, we're going to encourage our opposite arm and our opposite leg to clap together, okay? This is the movement they will need when they start to learn to crawl. And even walking, we walk with our arms and our legs often opposite sides, a bit like a horse. Okay, so cross crawling is a really useful thing to do. It gets both sides of our brain working together as well. So, are we ready? We're going to be a sheep. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a sheep, there. E-I-E-I-O. With a ba ba here and a ba ba there. Here a ba, there a ba, everywhere a ba ba. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O and stop. <gasps> now we need to do the other side because we've done one arm on one leg, so we're going to do that with our cow. 
Mm. We're gonna do a cow. Mm. So let's grab the other arm and the other leg. Are you ready? Ready, go. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a cow. E-I-E-I-O. Mm. With a moo here and a moo there. Here a moo, there a moo. Everywhere a moo, moo. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And stop. Mm. And the last one we're going to do today is our chicken, our chicken. Okay, and here's our wings. So he definitely needs to flap, okay? <laughs> Not that they go very far, do they, chickens? But we're gonna flap their arms and we're gonna bring their arms in and out, in and out. And we're gonna start by bringing their hands together, okay? But then we're going to try and bring it right across their body. Again, we're gonna cross that imaginary line that goes down the middle of their body, we call that the midline, and when we cross that, we really give our brains a bit of a workout rather than just stopping there, okay? So, are we ready? We'll start by clapping. So that we show them how to clap. Anybody clapping? Anybody when, anybody's little one already clapping? <gasps> Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a chicken. E-I-E-I-O With a cheep-cheep here and a cheep-cheep there Can we get them right across? Here a cheep, there a cheep, everywhere a cheep-cheep Old MacDonald had a farm E-I-E-I-O and stop Yeah, well done! Okay, so you can take one song and do so many different things with it Start with a big bounce um, go to something a little bit more different with um, the exercise and you can absolutely finish with a bounce um, as well. Should we do that? Let's finish with one more. Okay, what should we do? Oh, so I haven't got my cat, but let's be a cat. Meow, to finish with. Are we ready? Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O And on that farm he had a cat, meow E-I-E-I-O With a meow meow here and a meow meow there Here a meow, there a meow, everywhere a meow meow Old MacDonald had a farm E-I-E-I-O and stop <gasps> And my cat likes to chase the mice in the farmyard And the mice are going to go really quickly, are you ready? Quickly, 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 quick Old MacDonald had a farm and on that farm he had some mice, E-I-E-I-O, with a ee ee here and a ee ee there, here a ee, there a ee, everywhere a ee ee, old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and stop. <gasps> Fantastic, okay. If you would like to join us on our baby classes um, after Easter or any time, do give us a little message at info at kindermusicwithsarah.co.uk and hopefully we can get to meet you soon. Bye bye.